how, how? Okay. So we're, we're protecting this stuff in that's in mm -hmm. Good. How is it that that isn't in the original, um, when, when, the, when, the, when the TIF was, when, when, the, when the resolution was passed in 2015, and then when the subsequent TIF was passed in, I want to say 16? It's 15. Yeah, it's all on 15. How is it that this stuff isn't in there from that? A lot of it is. Uh, and I think the, but what we were addressing at that time was not the financing side. There was no financing um, uh, in place at that time. What we were addressing was compensation to the school district for agreeing to this structure. Um, and, you know, we essentially kicked down the road um, because it would not have gotten done if we hadn't um, kicked down the road the exact financing structure. And this financing structure will be in place across Hall of Fame Village. This is not specific to, you know, right, this deal right now is specific to property that the school district has fee simple interest in. But the key pieces for, uh, for the TIF financing and the key pieces for the compensation to the school district uh, are yeah, you know, they relate to the hotel, the performance center, everything else that is kind of off of our property. Um, and you, you know, there's no way to predict. I mean, we didn't know who the owners of that property are going to be. That property doesn't. It didn't exist in the city of Canton at the time, for the most part. It was in Plain Township and right. Plain Local School District. And so, are you saying we'd have to revisit it at that time, or this would anything that came on would have to go underneath this? Here's. Um, not underneath, but it'll be side by side. I, I, I guess the way I would say it. Um, there's three pieces of property that you own that are subject to this regime. You know, you've got the uh, you've got the stadium itself. You've got the youth fields, Scott Field, uh, to the south, and you've got the parking area to the west, the student lot, all of which are ground leased for the 100 year or 99 year period. Um, those are all intended to be part of the TIF. Uh, you don't do a TIF financing until you have improvements to the property, until you have a basis for determining what the increased value is, because what you're leveraging is only the incremental value. It's not, you know, the base value continues to pay tax, just like it uh, always has. Um, and so, uh, sure. 